So we want to make her where she's straighter. So I am going to pull you back just a little bit. because you can't move them very well. You see now how she looks nice and straight? And then I'm going to take and run my hand along her back to make sure that she's not too far forward or she's not too far back. I want her nice and straight so she's going to be lined up on her shoulders and lined up on her hips, okay? So she looks pretty straight right there. I think that looks pretty good. But I do I always kind of just take my hand and run it along my back to make sure that they're nice and straight. And then your centering point for it is going to be perpendicular to the posterior half of the thorax at the level T7, which is the inferior angle of the scapula. Can I do the angle on I do. I personally do not angle. It says that you can do a 10 to 15 degree cephalic angle if the patient doesn't lie in a horizontal plane. Most people will shoot one straight, look to see if the spaces are open, and if they need to, to angle, they will. Did you say cephalic? And your book says cephalic. Mm -hmm. So your centering point is going to be the level of the inferior angle of the scapula. There's her scapula. But once again, you need to get the lower portion of the T-spine. You have to have T12 on there L1. You're not going to find or get to see T1, 2, and 3. It just usually doesn't happen with the T-spine because of the shoulders. So you have to do a swimmer with it pretty much automatically. Very, very rarely do you ever see all the way down. So you always want to make sure you're going to get low enough, knowing you're going to get one, two, and three with your swimmers. So I'm going to, I will tend to send her a little bit further down for the lateral than what your book actually says. Isn't there okay. a little bit more magnification too? Meaning? Meaning that there's less on the film because she's farther away. Yeah, oh, yes, sorry. Okay. I was trying to figure out where you were. Yes. Yeah. So she'll be. Because the spine is lying it. here. Yeah. And it's not on mm -hmm. the. Yeah, so, yes, you were correct. And then you're going to collimate in side to side. And I'm going to collimate in to where you can just barely see light at, at the back. You can just kind of barely see it back there. And that is your lateral T-spine. Questions on that?